people always seem to know about the latest phone specs. But what do you know about upgrading your router to get the fastest Wi-Fi? Wi-Fi speeds have changed beyond recognition since it was invented. Comparing the capabilities of the ancient Wi-Fi 3 with the Wi-Fi 6 is like comparing a country road to an 8-lane expressway. Wi-Fi 6 uses 160 MHz channels, while Wi-Fi 3 had to manage with just 20 MHz. And now there's something even better. The 6 GHz radio spectrum has just been approved for use in Wi-Fi by U.S. authorities. And we're expecting to see it in other countries too. The result is the exciting new Wi-Fi 6E standard, which will revolutionize Wi-Fi. Products are on the way, including the world's first Wi-Fi 6E router from ASUS. So let's look at the benefits of this exciting new technology. Have you ever been annoyed by slow and unreliable Wi-Fi? The new 6 GHz frequency band solves many of the problems caused by the massive increase in Wi-Fi usage worldwide. The existing 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz frequency bands are becoming overwhelmed. But with the extra capacity of the 6 GHz band, future Wi-Fi can easily handle data-intensive tasks like video conferencing and streaming movies or TV. If your Wi-Fi is struggling to cope when lots of devices are connected, Wi-Fi 6E is great news, as the 160 MHz channels it uses are the fastest available. Existing 5 GHz Wi-Fi uses just two of these channels, but Wi-Fi 6E adds seven more. This gives Wi-Fi 6E the capacity to stream 4K video to multiple devices while downloading large files and playing online AAA games at the same time. Although any existing Wi-Fi devices can connect to a Wi-Fi 6E router, only new Wi-Fi 6E devices are allowed to use the new 6 GHz band. This means that your new Wi-Fi 6E devices, like your next-gen PC, smart TV, phones or game consoles, won't be slowed down by older devices, so overall Wi-Fi performance will be improved. Another good thing about Wi-Fi 6E is that it doesn't need a feature called Dynamic Frequency Selection, or DFS. This feature is used in 5 GHz, 160 MHz channels to prevent Wi-Fi devices from interfering with important things like military radar, satellite communications, and weather radar, but it can also disconnect Wi-Fi connections for over a minute. Wi-Fi 6E doesn't use DFS in the 6 GHz band, so connections are instant and you don't have to worry about being disconnected during a movie, game, or file download. Should you buy a Wi-Fi 6E router now or wait? The Asus ROG Rapture GTAXE 11000 router has been available since December 2020, and multiple categories of Wi-Fi 6E devices should follow during the first half of 2021. If you're building a new network and want to be 100% ready for the new Wi-Fi 6E devices, it makes sense to future-proof your network now with a Wi-Fi 6E router. Be a bold pioneer and step into the future with the world's first Wi-Fi 6E gaming router. Thank you for watching and goodbye.